I'm Jess. I'm a fitness instructor and content creator living in New York City, and this is part one of two, reviewing water bottles. Today is first impressions unboxing. <laughs> As you can see here, I do have a collection that has started from Lululemon. I used to be a Lululemon educator. I now am a Lululemon creator. You can always shop Lululemon with my link. It helps to support me here in the form of a small commission. But today I decided to expand beyond Lululemon and try out some different brands for water bottles. Now, I have also looked into Google Trends for this to see which bottles recently have started trending in Google searches, as well as checking on TikTok, getting recommendations from my TikTok audience, and just what kind of popped out to me on the internet. So let's start unboxing. I will give my first impressions and I can't wait to actually give these a long review. I will be doing lots of different tests on them, including how long it stays cold, how long it stays hot, if hot water can go inside the bottle, ice cube tests where we'll put an ice cube and see how long it took to melt. Also, are they leak proof? Can you use them in a car? Are they going to be better suited for something else? Like fitness classes. I am a bar instructor, so I definitely am going to be using these water bottles and bringing them with me to teach bar in New York City. I have some idea which bottles are in which boxes, but I'm not entirely sure. So this is going to be a surprise to me. And this whole video is about first impressions. So let's get into it. We've got what looks like two bottles wrapped in brown paper. Oh, Ooh. okay. First of all, this is the Yeti and let's see, Yeti Rambler 26 ounce bottle. Twist open, the bottle that knows, no bounds, good for alpine climbs, on hand H2O, hefty hot tea, extended treks, enough whiskey? I guess this is for ice cold, but is it also for hot? It does. Double wall vacuum insulation keeps drinks cold or hot to the last drop. So first of all, first impressions. That's what this is all about. This is very heavy. I feel like I'm engaging my biceps, but it definitely has heft to it. Woo, let's open it. Whoa, okay. Chug cap rundown, 100% leak proof, dishwasher safe, twists off for easy fill ups. I will say that this reminds me of an actual like plastic water bottle. So if you are used to drinking water out of a typical plastic water bottle, I feel like this is gonna give you some little reminiscent uh, vibes. <laughs> I just can't get over how heavy this feels. Definitely something that I'm gonna wanna carry in a bag or maybe you can clip it. But yeah, this is Yeti. I love this color. It looks very impressive and definitely substantial. Dishwasher safe because no one needs more work to do. Amen. Made with durable kitchen grade 18.8 stainless steel. Offers ice cold sips under the sun. So definitely gonna make sure to test this for how long it can last to keep the water cold as well as trying this with ice cubes. Seeing how long it takes for them to melt. Next up. I love this color. I'm gonna say right away, this is not as heavy as the Yeti. Definitely not. This feels like twice as heavy. Very, very heavy. But again, if weight is not an issue for you or you're looking for weight, maybe that's gonna be your number one choice. This is the Hydro Flask. I love this color, gorgeous. Hydro Flask, colder, hotter, longer. Wide mouth with straw lid. It says cold for 24 hours, hot for 12 hours. Temp shield, double wall vacuum insulation. Our unique insulation keeps your drink cold or hot for hours so you can stay refreshed for any adventure. Pro grade stainless steel, it's the same 18.8. BPA and toxin free, good to know, and dishwasher safe. Dishwasher safe is something really to keep in mind. Of course, if you have a dishwasher, I unfortunately do not, but I have had dishwashers in the past and sometimes I would get in the habit of not using items that weren't dishwasher safe because I would just get lazy about it and I would only use the things that were dishwasher safe. Now this has a straw lid as well. I, okay, putting pressure here, flipping it up. Definitely a nice wide opening. This clip is much smaller than the Yeti, which was like a full 
you could take a whole fistful. But because it's not as heavy, I don't mind that as much. The Yeti definitely feels heavy and substantial like a thermos that you would put food in. <laughs> but this is definitely much more light and I like the straw. Woo! Oh, and the straw comes out like this. And that's the Hydro Flask. This has come with bubble wrap. And I also ordered it with an accessory. I had no idea that the accessory would be this big. So let's start with the accessory. <laughs> this is a bottle brush <laughs> from Owala. And I'm not gonna lie, this kind of looks like a toilet brush. <laughs> Um, let's take a closer look, shall we? Twist and hide straw brush. It also has a place where you unscrew it, I guess. And uh, it says it's dishwasher safe. Hey, I have a straw brush and my bristles are antimicrobial. And it looks like there's like a smaller, tiny brush on the inside. And we're gonna see if this works for more than just this bottle. Here we go. I'll definitely say the packaging is really nice on this. Oh my gosh, this is so beautiful. This is Awala. Now this is one that I feel like is up and coming. I've been seeing a lot more posts online about it, but it definitely isn't one of the front runners. This is not one that everyone was telling me I had to, had to get, but I definitely think it's beautiful. And I'm really excited to try it. It's got 24 hours cold. So all three of the bottles we've opened already say 24 hours cold. BPA free, dishwasher safe, Stain and odor resistant, interesting. And this actually says not for use with hot, carbonated, or perishable liquids. I'm leak proof, I'm insulated, and I have a built-in straw. I know, where have I been all your life? <laughs> so this color scheme is so beautiful. I love this purple. It's also reminding me that they have some collabs with brands, so, Awala has a Friends themed set. They also have Star Wars. So definitely interesting that they are, in my opinion, maybe not the most popular right now, but they definitely have some huge collabs already under their belt. Let me know what you think. Lift to unlock. Good to know it locks. Push the buttons. So there's a button to push. Is it gonna spring open? Oh, that was a nice, that, ooh, ooh, I opened it and it did not just spring open. It had like a slow fade. Let's try that again. It's like, boom. Oh, this is really cool. So it's got a big opening here, but then it also has a smaller opening here. So it kind of looks like you can sip, but then you could also gulp. Very, very cool. So looked at Awala and they've actually got monthly color drops, but this one is called Retro Boardwalk. It's definitely giving me retro vibes which I love and you know, I could definitely see having a few of these in your collection just because there's so many really cool colors. Next up, whoa, oh, I'm so excited. Okay, first of all, this is huge. We've got some brown paper and then we've got some tissue paper. Can you guess what this is? It's the Stanley Tumblr. It's bigger than my face. Like what, what is that? This is the Stanley Tumblr and it is very, very popular. I'm so excited I was able to locate it because they're also really hard to come by. So I got mine from Dick's Sporting Goods, but they do have, of course, their own website and I find they're always out of stock, especially in the US. You know, wherever you can get your hands on one of these, give it a shot because they're very hard to find. This is the rose quartz color, which is gorgeous. And of course, I love everything pink. So it's definitely the color for me. And I'm including this in a water bottle comparison because I have water bottles from Lululemon and I have one tumbler from Lululemon. But this is just so popular. I wanted to see what the hype was about and see if it would replace a water bottle in my life or if it's really just gonna serve as a tumbler and I know that it fits in the car. So maybe this is just a road trip cup and not actually bring with me to class as a bar instructor, but I would love to stand the test. I would love to see if Stanley stands the test and if it will be a good replacement for a water bottle in certain situations. But let's see what it says. Quencher H2.0. It is the Quencher H2.0 tumbler. It's 40 ounces. I know they come in other sizes, but the 40 ounce is all I could get my hands on. All day hydration. Oh, interesting. 11 hours cold two days iced, seven hours hot. 
So this is definitely less than the bottles that we just looked at because they said 24 hours cold and I believe 12 hours hot. But again, like I said, you can't do a direct comparison because it is a tumbler. However, I am seeing if it's gonna work in my life. So, you know, we're gonna put it to the test. Flow state three position lid with rotating cover for versatility, no splash straw quencher, open drink spout, or fully covered and closed. So there's three options. Double wall vacuum insulation. So just like the others. Reusable straw, car cup holder compatible. Love that. Lifetime warranty. I've not actually seen that written on the other ones. Now it says splash proof, but it does not say leak proof. Dishwasher safe. I think everything's been dishwasher safe, honestly, in that so far. And recycled 18.8 stainless steel. Okay, so this is the first one that said recycled. Very interesting. First of all, this straw is not really pulling out, but I can feel resistance like there's little sticky parts there and I can see them. Kind of like when you stick a straw in the plastic at a fast food restaurant. Wow, it's so big. Oh my gosh. Woo! But it's so interesting. It's so big and I feel like the Yeti might even be heavier. So definitely something to think about here. This is definitely heavier. And this is only 26 ounces. I can't imagine what it's gonna be like with water in it. Whoa. <laughs> I wanna kinda, pu yeah, pull the straw out. Much easier if you pull it out this way. So I think you're supposed to go pushing it in. And then can I like change where this is? It does go, <laughs> but honestly it was so hard to get it started. But now I know that it can go. I'm not afraid to break it. Two hands helps out with that. So if you wanted to seal it, I definitely can't wait to try how, you know, leak proof that could be. I'm gonna say overall, all of the quality of these bottles is really great so far. I have been really impressed. Now, this is the company I'm most familiar with. I have had several Swell bottles in my lifetime and I'm excited to try a new style because I already know how the other Swell bottle compares and I love it, but let's try something new. Also, Swell definitely wins the award for most beautiful. Just from what this looked like online, I'm so excited. Ah, look at this marble color, it's so beautiful. This is the Swell Traveler Insulated Stainless Steel, 16 ounce, 470 milliliters. And I just love this pattern so much. First of all, this is the most aesthetically pleasing to me personally, because I love color. It is the only shiny one. The other ones are all matte and it has a wide opening. I'm excited to try. Woo! So one of my issues with the regular swell bottle styles is that it does keep water hot, but if it keeps it hot and you have a tiny little spout, it keeps it too hot and it kind of burns you, to be honest. So I'm excited to try this with the wider spout, both for cold and for hot. It says established in 2010 NYC. I didn't realize they were so new when I was trying them because <laughs> I've had a swell bottle for a really long time. Certified B Corporation, that's really cool. I have not seen that on any of the others. The color for this is Rose Agate? Rose Agate? Rose Agate? Agate. Triple layer insulation. Okay, I feel like the other ones have said double wall. Vacuum insulated, 18.8 stainless steel. No sweat, condensation free exterior. Thermoswell technology keeps cold for 24 hours, hot for 12 hours. This is hand wash only. And I remember that about my swell bottles. I could not put them in the dishwasher. That is definitely gonna give this one a little knockdown on the ranking, but it's just so pretty. So these are all of the new bottles that I'm trying, including this tumbler. First up, Stanley Tumbler. Next, Yeti. Next, Swell Traveler. Next, Hydro Flask. Oh, voila. Plus, we're gonna compare it with all of my Lululemon water bottles, back to life sport bottle, and hot and cold water bottle, as well as the Lululemon tumbler. Which one do you think's best? This was part one. Thanks so much for watching. If you're interested in buying any of these, I will be linking them below. And also, of course, shop with my link at Lululemon. Stay tuned for part two.